for the second time in eight days, the Columbus crew rolls out another rebrand after getting lots of fan pushback from this logo. Lots of people didn't like that, so the team has made a few tweaks to a new design. Now, it brings back the Columbus crew name to the design. It adds the number 96, which was so important to a lot of people. That's the year that the team was founded, and they think it has historic significance. So fans say these changes are a sign of how much the team cares about the supporters. And NBC4's Alan Henry is live at Historic Crew Stadium. So, Alan, the fans, they're no stranger to fighting for their team and now fighting for what they want, right? Oh, that's right, Colleen. Of course, it was just a few years ago that the Save the Crew campaign gained global recognition, not just among soccer fans, but the entire sports world. Uh, global recognition is one of the reasons why fans were confused and upset about this rebrand. They helped build up this team only to wake up last week and feel like they didn't even recognize it. Uh, members of the Crew's fan section, the Nordeca, had a meeting with the Crew's ownership last night in order to talk about and fix some of the missteps with this rebrand. On top of the change, Changes to the rebrand, the club is establishing a supporter liaison position that will work directly with the crew community. Now, the Nordeca will also be forming a fan council, and the team's ownership has agreed to meet with that council on a regular basis. Now, fans say it's a sign of how committed the owners are to the team and its supporters. These are things that don't happen a lot in professional sports, uh, and so for us to have our voices heard on this current issue. And then and it, and it be resolved with a compromise, but a good compromise. And then also to put, you know, mechanisms in place to build a better relationship going forward, I think uh, is a huge positive step. Well, that's not to say the fans are still 100% excited about the remaining changes to this rebrand, especially that new, new logo, I guess you could say. Many of them saying the previous crest is perhaps the only thing the previous owner of the team got right. Local for you, Alan Henry, NBC4.